Hi there, folks, welcome back to the channel. Welcome back to PGA Tour 2K21. Now we've got something very special for you guys today. Now, if you're not familiar with uh, Twitter or the TGC Tours forums, there's a bunch of designers that have just brought out a course. There's five designers, one plot of land, and there's five courses on that one plot of land. And the plot of land itself is called Whiskey Resort, and it's a keg collaboration project. So we're going to jump in and I'll talk a little bit about it. So as you can see, the first one off is Whiskey Run, and this is by B101. The wind speed is default, the wind direction is default. The fairways are soft, the greens are firm, the green speed is medium fast, time of day is morning. It's a bit overcast and it has crowds on. But I just jumped in to have a quick look there. I didn't see any crowds, so we shall make sure we turn crowds off. Because sometimes you, you do hear them in the background if they're turned on, but they're not there, if you know what I mean. So let's jump, jump into it and we'll get it started. So we are going off the black tees, 7,285 yards. Pin set number one. Well, let's get going. So, as I zoom around here, we're going to have a little look around. I'll read out what they've actually posted on TGC Tours forums. But we'll get the old sky cam up, and then we shall have a little zoom about. Tell you what, we're actually going to go right up. And we're going to go right up and have a look at the, the plot of land. As you see, that course there. That is Whiskey Run. But wait till you see this. Look at that. The whole plot is actually covered. So you've got five courses, one plot of land, five designers, and another designer by the name of Skinny Post. I think it was Skinny Post. Let me just have a little look. Yep, Skinny Post, he did the clubhouse. <clears throat> so this is going to be nice. And all very, very good designers as well. Uh, so what I'll do is I'll read this little bit out at the top here while we go down onto the first T, which is over... Yeah, I think. Yep, there we go. There I am there on the first tee. And look at that. Absolutely beautiful. Do you know what? I'm actually going to take a screenshot of that. I think that might be my thumbnail. Okay, Whiskey Resort, a keg collaboration project. Inspired by the Bandon Dunes Resort in Oregon, Whiskey Resort features five top quality courses on the same plot of land. Now, we began this project in late January, so you're talking seven, eight months ago they started this, guys. Uh, we began this project in late January with a view to creating three resort courses and seven months later with an extra two courses on top were finally there. Each course has its own distinct identity but they share commonalities too. Enjoy your rounds and we can't hear what you make of it. And the plant absolutely beautiful as well. Very nice. Now as I said this one is Whiskey Run and this is by a B101. Love the bunkers and that as well. So what you have here, you have Whiskey Run, you have Whiskey Dunes, you have Whiskey Trails, you have Whiskey Ranch, and then you've got a nine hole course, par three, uh, called the Decanter, which is nice. It's a, so there's a little bit here at the bottom as well. It's a hint. In a fun addition, all courses actually start from the same first tee box, just behind the clubhouse. That's pretty cool. Can't, yeah, I can't wait to play this. These are some of the best designers in the game. So who you've, you've got here? You've got B101, who did Whiskey Run. You've got Jay Chantres and JW Texan, who did Whiskey Dunes. You've got Energizer, who did Whiskey Trails. You've got BS Perry, who did Whiskey Ranch. And B101, again, did the Decanter. Now, this is just looks like... This is a... No, it's not the same course, I was going to say, because if you go on a different course, the flag probably won't be there. So that's the same course there. Oh, I imagine it won't be. Ah, uh, there you go, see, yep. There's just a, a marker on there. So that's the end of that course there. But this is going to be good. Five courses on one plot of land. <laughs> as bloody it is. I've, I've heard them doing... I've played one or two where there's been maybe one or two courses on the same plot of land, but not five, five courses. That's bloody amazing. And I tell you what, for using the whole plot of land, it's actually, the frame rate is really, really good. Very, very good. 
Yeah, I was actually going to jump on and do my career mode on the PGA Tour, but this popped up yesterday. I thought, oh, I'm going to have to go on and try and get a couple of these done just to show you guys just what kind of things these um, designers can come up with. Absolutely fantastic. And you've got a little bar over here. Very nice. Yeah, there you go. Look, got pumps up there as well. Okay, right. I do like, where was it? I've seen this tree over here. That's pretty cool. One of them silver, those silvery looking trees there. That's pretty cool, that is. Look at that. Very nice. What the hell is that doing there, though? A bench just <laughs> hanging there. I don't know why that's there. But that's pretty cool. And um, we'll probably use that as a screenshot when we do play on this course, because as you see, that's a just a marker there on the green, so that's off on the different course. So we're going to head back up to the clubhouse. Here's a clubhouse up here. And there I am. And as you can see, here's all the tee markers here. The one, two, you've got three, and you've got four. Now, one of them will probably be for the, as you said, they're all from the, the different courses. So yeah, you're hitting off down that way. And you're hitting off down that way. And it looks like you're hitting off that way. And then you're going off that direction. Pretty cool. So let's get this started anyway. <clears throat> Looking forward to this. So it looks like we're starting off with a par 5. 530 yards, 50, yard, uh, 50 feet down. Wind is pretty low, so let's hope we can hit a nice one off the tee here. A little bit of a fast, but that'll do it. Got the old shorts on today. Get the old pins out, get a bit of sun on them. Not a bad looking drive as well, but it looks like we're going to have a, a left to right slope and lie here going into the green. Not too bad. Okay, 256, six down, so it's playing 254. That should be okay. Let's just bring it back just a little bit because you're going to get quite a bit of run on that. So another little bit of a fast start. But that's turning quite a bit. Oh, we might get a good kick off this side hill here. Oh, and we do. Oh, come on, pull up. That is not bad. That sets us up on a green for an eagle. Oh, look at you, putting for eagle now. That's fine work. Fine work indeed. Okay, twelve feet. This putt for the eagle. One is down. Does it go? No, we just missed it. Now, I know there's a big update, well, not a big update, I think it was 200 megabyte on the PC. I hope it sorted everything out for you guys on the consoles, because I didn't have any real issue on the PC. Okay, part four, 467 yards. Let's hit another nice one here. There we go, boomer. Just love the sound of that when it comes off the driver. And as you see, the amount of little humps and bumps, all the undulations got in the fairway as well. Just adds that little bit of extra difficulty to your approach shots. Okay, 154, 10 up, so it's playing around about 157. So we're going to go up to the 161 with the 8 iron. That should be good. And a bit of a left to right slope there as well. Little bit of a fast, and it's still turned to the right there. Look at that. But that is not bad distance wise. We'll take that. Well oh, that's a nasty looking little putt, though. Okay, 10 foot, one inch up. This is going to turn pretty sharp off the club face. Oh, we just missed it again on that left hand edge there. So not bad. Par par start. Don't oh, know. We've got a birdie on the first. It was a par five, wasn't it? That's right. Yep. Okay. 221. 12 down. So that's playing round about 217. 190. I don't think that'll get over that bunker, you know. It might because of that wind. Do you know what? I think we're going to try that. I reckon that'll get over the bunker. Oh, we hit so fast. 
Damn it. Uh, hopefully it's going to kick into the right. It does. Oh, I'll tell you what, that worked out okay. Quite glad I got that fast. <laughs> okay. right, let's see if we can get the putting sorted out here. Right, 14 foot, one inch up. Turn in. Oh, we're just skimming the edges here. Nice bunker work. I love the, the long grasses and that as well. So he's done a cracking job on this. Okay, short par four. We should be able to smack one right up there. So if you don't hit fast. Oh, that is not too bad actually. That's just off the perfect. Just kicked a little bit to the left. Come on, pull up for me. Yeah, you got a lot of uphill lines, downhill lines, side hill lines. Okay, 36 yards, five feet up. Quite a big. Oh, we get to perfect. Come on, baby. All right, pull up for me. Oh, that went past quite a bit. Yeah, you'll take that. Here we go. Birdie putt coming up. Okay, let's see if we can get this one. Ten feet. One inch up. Finally, one drops. The old tattoo golf t-shirt on that. Polo shirt. Okay, another par four. 500 yards. Let's just see if we can smack one right down. I, mean, I do like that sort of dead tree there as well. Pretty cool. What a beautiful view though, look at that. So like I said, say to you guys who haven't actually played TG, any of the TGC games or TGC 2019, compared to the developers, these designers that we have, the community designers, they absolutely amazing what they can come up with. Oh, nice. Another nice one. Looks like we're heading to the fairway here. Very nice. Another nice big drive that 323 four yards. <laughs> okay, 185. Let's just put a little bit of loft on. Let's come down on the ball, try and get it to stop that a little bit quicker. Oh, a little bit of a slow. It's going to push it over to the right. It should pull up pretty quick, and that's not too bad. Okay, 14 feet, 5 inches down. No, 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 hit that too hard. Yeah, I can tell straight away. So, take another part of that. Okay, bunker right in the way there. So we're going to aim over to the right hand side of it here. That wind should just push it a little bit into the left. Oh, but it's fast. Uh oh. Not quite sure. Looks like it's heading right for that bunker. And there we go. Magnetic bunkers. <laughs> they are for my balls anyway. Damn it. So that's not too bad though. It's only 128. And let's bump up to the pitch and wedge. 80, 40, 92%. Mm, yeah, we're uphill line as well, so I'm going to actually leave it there. Oh, we get the perfect anyway. Now, how's the distance? Ooh, well short. Another club. That would have been. Okay, we're not going to go with the pitch. Go with... Probably go with a flop shot here. Yeah. 
That should pull up lovely. Come on, come on, come on, come on. There we go. So we'll have another par here. Okay, on to the seventh. And um, we've got another par five here. Okay. Well, we've got 544 yards, but this has got a good chance of reaching that bunker, you know. So I don't know whether it aims to the left or the right. I think I'm going to aim just a little bit to the, the right of the bunker here. And then that's going to add more distance to it. If I aim to the left, it might get a chance of getting on in two. So I'm going to try it right down the side of this fairway here. Oh, no. Damn it. Can it kick? No, that's in the bloody bunker. Damn. K4 hybrid, that is not going to go over that lip. Eight irons, good chance of getting over that. Tell you what, put loft on it as well, just to make sure we go over this lip here. And we do, and we get the perfect, that should be okay. Okay, 130 and seven up, so it's playing 132. Oh, there's not a lot of landing space there. Look at that. Slopes off there, there as well, and all down here. So I want to be just right at the pin here, to be honest. That wind should push it over a little bit. Oh, let me have a look. No, that wind's going to push it over more than that. Oh, big, nasty slow. Plum and heck. No, not we're in the bunker. Again. That was a terrible shot. Absolutely terrible. Okay, we'll go with the splash. We put, come right down at plenty of spin. Try and get it to stop pretty quick. And that should be okay as long as it doesn't go anywhere near that slope. That's a shame. Just mucked up a par five there. Nice. That little um, pitch shot we had. Oh, well, approach shot, should I say. Two under for the round. Still two under though, on the eighth. Not too bad. Right oh, that's quite a tough pin to get to. Definitely not going to go with a four hybrid. Come on. Oh, just a touch fast, but it might make it. That's going to turn lovely. Oh, nice. That should set us up for a nice birdie putt now. Tell you what, the greens aren't easy. Oh, shit. What am I doing? <laughs> Reload. Oh, I can't believe I did that. I saw a it's like a delayed reaction on my thumb. <laughs> oh, that was a, such an easy birdie as well. Right, oh, look at this again. Sloping off there, but we should be safe if we aim to the left here a little bit, I think. We'll aim right at the pin, let that wind just push it a little bit to the left. Okay, 158, nine downs, just playing 155. 155. Right. Hmm. I'll tell you what, we are going to go there. Oh, hit that fast again. Not good. Way, way over to the left. Okay, splash shot. Oh, let's get that back. All the way back to 17 yards. Try and get this to stop a little bit quick as well. And that'll do. Hopefully we'll pick up the par here. Yeah, I think the, the last, I don't know, four or five rounds, it's my irons I'm having problems with. 
Not too bad off the team, my driver. It's just my ions. Okay, that's the end of the front line. Two under, not too bad. 493 yards, par four. Should be able to just smack one up the middle here. Oh, bit of a slope. But there's quite a wide open fairway. That should be fine. Big kick to the left there. Massive kick to the left. Now it looks like we're going to be left with a right to left lie as well. Yes, we are. Okay, 178. Two foot down. I think we should go with the the 170. We'll go with the seven iron. That should be okay. That is a big slope. Oh, we get the perfect though. Nice. Oh, that wind's actually pushing it more than what the slope is. Hopefully it kicks off. Come on, it should turn down. Yeah, there we go. Beautiful. Absolutely beautiful. There we go. Nice birdie putt. Yeah. Can't really cut that corner, so I think the safest bet is probably playing down here as long as we don't hit a slow. Oh, well, we had a little bit of a fast, but that should be okay. Aimed it way over to the right. That's not bad at all. And hopefully it just this lands in this little flash spot right there. That's not bad. Okay, 119, 11 feet up. So that is playing around about 123. A little bit of a slow. I'm really struggling to try and get my tempo on my irons. Oh, a little bit of a, a, little bit of a bite on the green there. A little bit of a spin back. Thirty-two feet, one foot up. That's turning lovely though. Oh ho 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 that was so unlucky. That was a nice putt, I'll take that. Okay, time to finish this one off. Okay, let's scope out our standings now. Okay, next par five. Par five ahead of us. Twelfth hole. It is 560 yards now. If we hit a nice wall, look at that. If that wind was going the other way, that would have been absolutely perfect. But we're going to have to aim it just down here. Nice swing on that. Little bit of a slow. It's quite wide up here, as long as it doesn't run out. Come on, pull up for me. Just over 300 yards. So we have got a chance of reaching this. Oh, I don't know with that window. I think. Oof, oof, it's going to be so close. I think that might hit that. Oh, I don't know. Do you know what? Let's just go for it, shall we? Try and maybe go into the overswing a little bit. Oh, we hit perfect. 101. Come on, get up there. Oh, just. I'll take that any time as a. Leave that little chip in. Oh, so close. So we'll take the birdie anyway. Gives a chance at an eagle there, but we'll take the birdie. Right, I think we'll go this side. That wind should take it right over the top of that. That should be good. 
Okay, kicking down right into this little hollow down here. 327, not bad at all. all right, 56, 8 up, so it's playing around about 59. Oh, that's a massive fast. Oh dear. Pull up, come on, pull up. Oh, that stopped nice. There was a little slope to the back there. I thought that might have caught that. Oh, it's not turning. No. So we'll take the part. Oh, I do like the little par threes though. One, tw one thirty-two, twenty-seven down. So that's playing. Oh, around right about one twenty-three. One eighteen. Do you know what I think that's going to be absolutely spot on? Oh, we get the perfect sweet as a nut. Go on. Oh, too much loft on it. That was nice as well. Oh, I hit that way too hard. I need to slow down on my putting, I think. We're actually struggling here to get the par now. Come on. Nope. Oh. When you're putting... And you're actually on the yellow line or sort of that yellowy greenish line. It just moves off the putt ahead so, so quickly. That's a bogey. That's not good. I mean, that was a nice shot off the tee. You should not have missed that putt, though. That was terrible. Bit of a fast. I think that should be okay. Yeah, that's going to be fine. Might kick off a little bit to the left here. Nope, that's okay. Second shot here on the fifteenth. Okay, right, what have we got? Okay, we get the perfect. Oh, how the hell was that that no? That's a couple of times that's happened now. I don't know how that's happening. That's so weird. Must be under hitting it. Just a touch. Yeah, I thought that was going to be a good shot there, that pitch as well. Because we hit the perfect. But as I said, I think I... Oh, stop talking when you're putting, Jim. <laughs> It's not so bad because I'm, I'm just showing this course off. Usually, if you've watched me in 2019, I've always said that when I'm showing courses off for these designers and stuff, it's it's neither here nor there what I score, to be honest. Don't get me wrong, I do like to score well, but I'm just um, mainly showing the course off what these guys do. And it's also a nice, enjoyable round of golf as well. But I think when I do play the PGA and things like that, then I try to take my time. That's not too bad, but we're going to be left, I think, on a big right to left slope, yeah. A 330 yard drive, yeah, a few mistakes I've made, not too bad. Okay, par 5, right, I'm going to drop it down, to 4 hybrid. Oh, do you know what, I might even come off over even more here. That is turning pretty good. Oh, go on, baby. Oh, can you imagine if that went in? That would have made up for them two bad holes back then. <laughs> but we could get the eagle here. No, it turned. I thought that was in. So that's a birdie. That should have been an eagle. Okay, it looks like we've got another par five coming up as well. 
number 17. Okay, 534. That's pretty short as well. Let's, let's head down this direction here. Oh, do not pull too much to the left. Come on. Lovely course to get out there with a the shorts and t-shirt on there. A uh, polo shot. Very nice. Okay, 237, 22 ups. It's playing on about 244. 248. Let's pull that back. Let's try that. Oh, bit of a fast. Come on. Kick in for me. Kick in. Come on. Oh, you little beauty. You little beauty. Now, can we convert one of these eagles? Come on. Well, that's a few. That's a couple we've missed, I think. Can we get this one? Oh, that's not easy. That is not easy. All right. Drop this putt and secure that eagle. Let's do it. Oh, I've done it again. Mop it. I can't believe that. You absolute muppet. <laughs> but at least we got the birdie out of it. Oh, way down here. This might run out, you know. Oof, 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 I don't know. I could go over. Nah. Do you know what I think? Well, that's 508 yard par five. Uh, par four. I think we'll be good. Let's go for it. A little bit of a fast. Bet it runs out now. Should I, should I have went with a three wood? I know, that's plenty of room. It's going to run right down here. Yeah, that's absolutely fine. Okay, about, I'd say 185 or so to the pin. Okay, 183. Eight up, so it's playing around about 186. John, you were wrong. You were yelled off. 180, 183. Oof. <laughs> Right. Let's see if we can hit a nice one for the last hole. No, so again, done slightly in the fast. But is it going to kick in? Come on, come on, come on. Oh, 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 oh so close. So we should pick up the par here. Oh, oh, oh. Oh, oof. wow. So, there you go guys, that is a whiskey run, and that was by B101, and that is part of Whiskey Resort. Five courses, one plot. So, I hope you enjoyed that. I will do the other courses, as I said, there was five courses, but I hope you enjoyed that. Thanks for watching guys, I'll catch you again next time. And don't forget, to stay safe.